Oh, wow. Nice. That's a real slow effect there. Perfect. And now it's gonna go back to 100%. And that's all you have to do. Wanna make your DJI 5 footage look like fire in slow motion? Let's jump into the Vincent Resolve and I'll show you how. Let's go. Okay, so you can only shoot slow motion in 24 frames per second, 60 frames per second, 120 frames per second, and 240 frames per second footage. However, stick around to the end and I will show you how to still get the slow motion effect on regular video footage. So it's two things you can do. You can slow down the entire footage, regular speed will help, will be him doing this here. Click play. And that'll be his regular speed. Or what you can do is you can slow down the entire clip. So what you can do is you can right click there and you're gonna click retime control. Now we retimed him. Now he's not going in slow motion no more. He's going 100%. So we're gonna go to the area where we want to slow it down at. Where they duck that tree right there. So what we're gonna do is we're going to spread this over so we can see it better. This here. So let's create a speed point. So you have to hit the black arrow, which is right here. And we're gonna add speed point there. And you will see by that level there, you will see that little bitty stone right there. That's what I'm gonna call it. And let's go here and let's create another speed point. That's what we're gonna slow it down. All right, so we're gonna create the speed point there. All right, so there's two speed points. We got 100%, 100%, and that's a third one. So let's even add one here. So what we're going to do is we're going to do the same thing the arrow, add a speed point. So now we've got one, two, three, four. All right, so let's slow down this one right here. Well, he's ducking. We're gonna slow that one down. So all you have to do now, same concept, black arrow. We're gonna change the speed now. Let's change the speed to 10%. Notice it went all the way out because it slowed the speed down to 10%. So now let's replay the footage and let's see what happens once he clear that look. That's exactly what happens. He clear that. Okay. Now, if you're getting any kind of jerky movement, the only thing you want to do is you're going to go over here and you're going to click real-time process you're gonna click that arrow you're gonna go to optimal flow optical flow and then on the motion you're gonna click that and you're gonna click enhance better so now we're gonna play it again and watch this it's much smoother all right and he's still going slow and now at this point here he will go back to regular motion. But that is a very, I love that cinematic effect there. That's all you gotta do and back to regular and he goes. No jerk, no nothing. All right, so that's that part there. Okay, so let's do this part here. Same concept. Remember, remember how we did that, right? Okay, so. We're gonna go over this, we're gonna hover here. If you wanna slow the whole thing down, you can, but we're not gonna do that. What we're going to do is we're going to remember, right click, real time controls. That's telling you it's going 100%. You see the arrows facing that way to the right. It'll be right on your screen there. <laughs> All right, so that's 100%. So we're going to, let's slow it down when he's going for the layup. That's about right here. All right. So now we got to do, 
you see the black arrow add the speed point right there so pass that arrow here we're going to slow it down let's slow this down to about 10 percent y'all 10 percent okay so all we're going to do now we're going to play it and watch this look at that and he goes there he does this move and that's that all right so notice you can still add an access point here to put it back to 100 if you want to we'll just add an access point now what we'll, uh add that speed point right here and we will add it back to 100 percent there all right so now we got this here and let's let it play out 100 he slows it down he does this move he completes the basket and then it goes back to regular motion right there all right so this is the bonus for you who do not have it recorded in them frames per second that i told you have to slow it down you can still do it in regular footage and i will show you how to change it in the clip so let's go okay so let's just cut these clips out the way let's cut this clip out the way okay so all you will have to do with this here which of the clip that you want to add the effects to you can choose so let's just do this one right here so you will hold this first right and you will right click and then you're going to go down and we're going to click on clip attributes people's clips attributes we're going to click on that you see this right here these are the frames per second 25 frames per second remember you can do slow motion but let's just do it to 60 frames per second boom so all you gotta do click ok now we know we got this in the frames per second where we can slow it down so now it's just going regular you see i'm going regular right there okay now let's just slow the entire clip down here remember you can do it any point you want to do it to make it cinematic that's your decision i'm just showing you how you would do it so let's do let's wait till it get here right here so we're going to do what remember either control r on your windows or you do command r on mac or you can just right click and do real time controls and that's the whole thing at one percent but at that point we'll leave it there and we'll click the black arrow remember you gotta add a speed point first that's your speed point but let's spread it out so you can see what's going on that's the speed point and at that point let's slow this thing down about let's do 25 percent this time right so we're gonna spread it on back remember let's go back to here and we're going to add another access point just to put it back to regular speed so the black arrow will be here and we're going to add a speed point you have to add a speed point before you can slow it down or speed it up okay so we're going to click on this set so that'll control this section here so we're going to change that arrow back and change the speed but remember you want to hit the arrow that's in your access point your speed point your speed access so we'll hit the arrow here and we'll change the speed back to 100 so now we've got three different versions 100 slow down back to regular speed let's see how that plays out and let's click play slow down 25 percent and now he's gonna go back to fast motion and that's it but remember all you had to do make sure you got this project settings optimal flow 
it's the free version you don't have to have the paid version like i have you can do this in the free version as well and then on your motion we're going to do that to enhanced better and we'll play it again click play slows down and boom and then it goes back to regular speed and that's that let's make it even slower let's make that 10 percent let's click play and we're gonna click play boom and so what we got here oh wow nice that's a real slow effect there perfect and now it's gonna go back to 100 and that's all you have to do all you have to do so if this helped you out, give it a like and consider subscribing for more tips on how to get the most out of your gear. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace.